I'm going to put my wire, put my string through the, uh, the foam. Slide everything through here. Line it up and put it in place. I'm going to attach my holding screws for the test. my foam in and it's in place. Now I'm going to be using this nice little uh, silk parachute that I got uh, from one of my model rockets and so I've got me a, a little ring here that I'm going to attach to it. First thing I find works good is to tie these up. You want to make sure that your parachute opens up perfectly. It's not all tangled up like mine currently is. Let's untangle them. Make sure my strings are not tangled. And then what I usually do is I tie a knot down here near the end, a loop, that helps keep the lines in place so they don't get tangled. So nice little loop knot there. And that way parachute strings are all intact. Now put my little key ring on here. Make it easier to disconnect the parachute when I need to. Now I want a certain certain amount of drag chute so I go to a certain point and in my length I tie me a loop Trim the excess off and attach it to the ring. So now we got the parachute with the system. Take your drag chute, fold it, very carefully wrap it. You don't want it too tight. Place your foam in, put your parachute in place, close your door, 
You want your servo out? Bring your rubber band in and around. So get in place. And now we're ready to turn on the switch.